The lecture entitled Triple Helix Model, a key to fostering innovation in Nigeria universities, explored the interconnectedness of the academia, industry, and government in proffering solutions to societal problems through innovative collaborations. The vice chancellor noted that through researches, inventions, and technology transfer, Universities can play pivotal roles in achieving societal goals and not only contributing to body of knowledge. He urged the academia to be entrepreneurial by engaging in patents and innovations that will be mutually beneficial to industries and government rather than being mere beneficiaries of philanthropic donations. If government and industry, industry play their roles well, then you will find that this innovation from the universities will become easier and the country will uh, be the better for it. The Dean, Faculty of Engineering, Professor Emmanuel Ogujo, and other attendees described the triple helix model as a beautiful idea that should be fully adopted and implemented in Nigeria. There are various innovative researches that are going on. But because the fund is not there, or the fund is not adequate, let me put it in that way, uh, you see that after these things have been done, uh, they remain at the prototype level. It's a case of trying to make um, research to be problem-based. So what that means is that you don't just do research for the sake of doing research. Your research should be driven by the need to solve a problem. I'm recommending that every educational institution should buy the idea of that triple model. Uh, the triple Ellis uh, model, so that at least we can have a sustainable uh, development in our nation, Nigeria. The guest lecturer, Professor Aluyo, is a product of the University of Benin and also lectured in the Faculty of Engineering before taking up appointment as the first vice chancellor of Edo University, Ozare. In Benin, Jude Abugu, NTN News.